right. Um, my final question, <clears throat> if I may. Um, gym owners, I spoke to one a couple of weeks ago, just ahead of them being allowed to, to reopen. And um, you told me that he had um, raised the issue with, I believe it's the Ministry of Health or, or the Cabinet, um, whichever, that um, the, the, the possibility of them getting some concessions to bring in a lot of the sanitization equipment, a lot of things, the, 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 the masks that will allow their members to work out, um, you know, without affecting their breathing and so forth. They said that they asked for that. Um, so my question is, is, was any of that um, considered and was it done? And um, in terms of other businesses in, in other industries that are now being allowed to reopen, they might need uh, to spend a little bit more to outfit their, 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 um, their enterprises with these things. Are there any plans to offer concessions to some of these new reopened um, businesses? You know, I made the, the, the push to, to increase revenue from the government side. Uh, concessions is a dirty word at this point <laughs> in time with the government. Uh, but I would say that uh, if it does help to improve the overall health of the environment, uh, consideration could certainly be given. Uh, I'm not aware that those concessions were requested and denied. Uh, I think the appropriate channel for that would be through uh, the minister with responsibility for sports. Um, and uh, I am satisfied that if uh, the gym owners as a collective would indicate that in, 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 in an attempt to make them uh, more compliant with the prescriptions of the government that they would look at, uh, you know, having these available for their members such that they could keep their membership and the environment healthy. I don't think it's something that the government would be um, frowned upon, would frown upon. But I'm not aware that the requests were made, and if they have been, it would be an opportunity for them to um, nudge in the minister again for the representation to be made at the appropriate level. But I say concessions are a bad word because uh, this is the point in time where government revenues are precipitously low in a number of areas. And even yesterday when we had the discussion with the Ministry of Finance officials, that was one of the areas that they cautioned the government that it should really um, tighten the reins on the uh, allocation of uh, discretionary concessions at the port. And so this is why I indicated to you that Concessions are a bad word at this particular point in time. It's not going to last forever. We believe that there are sometimes these incentives um, can generate and stimulate economic activity. But at the particular point in time right now, the government needs all of the revenues that it, it can avail itself of. All right. Thank you, Minister.